Now, warning, this story is boring, but it's not what you might think. A group of students from the University of Warwick is preparing to fly to the United States for the final of an international competition. It's organised by the entrepreneur Elon Musk. The Not A Boring competition was created to discover the quickest and most efficient means of digging a tunnel. And the Warwick Boring Team, as they call themselves, are one of 12 teams who will be in Nevada for the final. David James takes up the story. This group of students are designing and building what they hope will be the world's fastest tunneling machine. The team only learns they had beaten nearly 400 other teams to reach the final of Elon Musk's Not A Boring competition back in March this year. So they've had just five months to turn their concept into a technical design, raise sponsorship and build a working prototype. None of us entered this with any significant tunneling experience and here we are with you know, the significant parts of a machine, you know, all of it coming together and it's because we just said, let's just figure it out. And that, that mentality has stuck with us the whole way. The team have come up with totally new solutions to some of the hardest challenges that tunnel boring presents. And that's why Elon Musk is running this competition. He wants to find brand new ways to make tunneling faster, cheaper and more accurate. Because this is a competition, the exact shape and functions of the machine are remaining secret for now. But the founder of Warwick Boring is confident their machine will impress. We want to win uh, everyone, so we are not just going there just to show it around and have a networking. It's good as well, but we have technology which might really, it will really excite Lots of people over there, specifically even uh, competition organizers, but also the industry. The team has already impressed the local businesses and university staff who have supported them. Well, it's extremely exciting. Um, this is an amazing opportunity, especially when it's attached to the name of Elon Musk. Uh, the students are uh, unbelievably talented, you know, to be able to come up with their designs um, and their ideas, and they're very innovative. So what do the students think about having the chance to turn learned theory into a practical, innovative solution? I think it's a necessary experience for everyone in university to do at least one project that's hands-on, that's in a team, like knowing how a real work environment like WNG is. Figuring stuff out, doing research, working with these guys, you know, trying to like solve problems all the time, it's been a really good experience. What I'm learning in uni is very theoretical. And this is a great opportunity to get to learn really hands-on stuff. In just a few days' time, this team of students will fly to America to begin two weeks of quarantine before they get the chance to prove they can bore their competition into oblivion. David James, BBC Midlands Today, the University of Warwick. And we will let you know how they get on with their boring invention.